do when you pick up a dandelion? You're gonna blow it, you're gonna make a wish. How many times have we done that as a child? This is something we can all appreciate. Wish is a structure of mine that we built about five years ago. It's a dandelion sculpture. It's 50 feet tall. It's covered in these big aluminum seeds. They light up and it's a figurative piece of dandelion losing its seeds in the wind. My name is Rob Buholtz. This is my studio, Robert James Studio. I'm really excited about this project going out to Basel. It's been a dream of mine for quite some time. I feel like really good art is all made by hand and it doesn't matter how many tools, how many CAD programs you have, this is where all of our work happens, on the table, working with our hands. This is a piece of uh, structural steel that we use on a lot of our projects. It's a nice example of how we take a straight piece of pipe, we cut it up, we bend it, we twist it around, we weld it back structurally, we put all these cool gussets on it, and then we do like mirror mosaics and glass mosaics on the outside of the structural steel. It's kind of our brand, we've been doing it for a couple years, it makes all this steel just kind of like pop. We've got a lot of balls in motion right now. We just got a call this morning from our freight broker that says that we have to have Wish loaded up and ready for uh, shipping tomorrow. We're scrambling to get everything together tonight. We're loading up all the tools, getting all the trucks together, welders, and everything we're gonna need for Miami, and we're throwing it on the trailer, and then it's off to Basel. It's very universal in thought. Every kid has played with a dandelion. Prior to this, my honest opinion was that Art Basel was turning more into a party scene. This is taking it back to the art. Art Basel 2015, this is my favorite piece hands down.